We are learning more tonight about an RCMP officer accused of beating and sexually assaulting an 11-year-old boy. He was arrested along with a woman after the child was found wandering around an Ottawa neighborhood. We can't report a lot of the details to protect the children involved, but as our Ottawa Bureau Chief Jacques Bourbeau reports, local residents are talking. A police van brought the 41-year-old accused RCMP officer into Ottawa's courthouse this morning. After meeting with a doctor, the Mountie made a brief court appearance. He's accused of beating and sexually abusing a young boy. And he and a woman also face charges of forcible confinement and failing to provide the necessaries of life. The child is believed to have been locked up for months in the basement of a suburban Ottawa house, shackled and handcuffed. Earlier this week, he managed to escape, and he was found wandering the streets, starving and dehydrated. Tuesday afternoon, I saw him because he came to the backyard trying to turn on the faucet to get some water. And then he turned up his head because he had his hood on, and then he said to me he wanted some water. I did not think enough to, to, to realize, hey, this is something really wrong. So I feel bad about that. Soon after arriving at the house, Ottawa police arrested the RCMP officer and child abuse investigators were called in. Soon after, a 34-year-old woman was also arrested and police say there was more than one victim. News of the arrests shocked the residents of this neighborhood, but one neighbor says he had a previous run-in with the RCMP officer. The neighbor says one day his two dogs accidentally got loose and the RCMP officer flashed his police badge and threatened to shoot the dogs. The RCMP won't say much about the accused, other than he's been suspended and has not been on active duty since May of 2011. Although court documents suggest he was a member of the RCMP's anti-terrorism unit. A lot of the details about this case can't be reported because of a publication ban. But one police officer was willing to say this is a case of horrific abuse. Jacques Berbeau, Global News, Ottawa.